I've never dared to dream of becoming a queen. But through luck and love, that's exactly what happened. Hurry up, Margaret. We're waiting for you. I want to be the best stepmother to Princess Snow White. And I'll always be there to serve my kingdom as well. We're entering the Royal Forest, Your Majesty. We should be home soon. I can't wait for the feast in our honor. Hmm. That's strange. Only the Princess came to meet us, Your Majesty. I'll have to take care of the horses myself. I'm so glad to see you, Snow White. You've grown so much. But what's happening? The castle is so empty. Hello, stepmother. Father is away on urgent business, and the servants are busy preparing your feast. Why don't you go to your room to rest while they finish setting up? Take this part of the key for the new gate. I left the other part nearby, but I'm sure you can find it. In the meantime, I'll gather your favorite flowers from the garden.
Why isn't anyone coming? Where are the servants? Guard! Guard! There's a murderer in the castle. They killed the royal page. Take Snow White somewhere safe, and then find them. Everything is fine in the castle, your majesty. What? But... The page is dead. And Snow White or I could be next. Everything is fine in the castle, your majesty. He's under some sort of spell. I'll just have to do this myself. What are these creatures? Where is the chef? What's happening in my castle?
My mother died, but father has found a new love. I'm not upset, though. What is a kingdom without a queen? Besides, she's very nice to me. Rumors are going around about me. The servants are all afraid of me, but especially the nannies. Yet, my father still sends them. He doesn't know the fate that awaits them. The day will come when my father and stepmother both learn the truth about who I really am. It's getting harder to hide. Would you like to join the feast, stepmother? Uh! No, 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 I need to walk this quicker. Stepmother, it's me, Snow White. Why have you locked yourself away from me? I'd married King Philip years before, and ever since we'd pray to the gods for an heir. But unfortunately, those prayers were left unanswered. Until one day when I heard a baby crying on my way home.
It was a girl of extraordinary beauty with black hair, pale skin, red lips, and astounding eyes. We named her Snow White, and she was growing into a thoughtful, intelligent child. I couldn't understand why the maids were so afraid of her until I saw her feeding. I ran, but I knew she had seen me. I can sense her waiting for me just beyond the door. Mirror, what happened? That... that's not possible. It can't be true. <laughs> Come to me, Margaret. This stone will show you the way. Escape me, stepmother. Tell me how to use the magic mirror and reign beside me. You'll always have subjects, and I'll always have food. Never! The kingdom deserves better. So be it. You can watch from here as your beloved kingdom falls.
Queen Margaret. I thought I'd lost you, but then I heard the horn. I'll help you escape. There used to be a rope ladder here. Your Majesty, I saw you running from Snow White, so I followed you. What's happening? The guards are enchanted, so we can't go back. I need to find the witch who lives in the lighthouse. She'll help us figure out what's happening to Snow White. Hmm. I've heard about the witch on the other side of the ridge. If we can get into the old mines, they'll lead us under the mountains to get there. Get away from us, you filthy creatures! Run, your majesty! I'll hold them back!
My queen, forgive me. I've been sleeping more and more in my old age. <laughs> I'm Fringela, a hereditary witch. I know what brought you here. Snow White? She... she's a monster. Was she enchanted? Why does she drink other people's blood? I'm sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but she was born like this. Her thirst for blood gradually changed her. There's no way to disenchant Snow White. Only death will stop her. I must... kill Snow White? Stepmother, look what I made! This bracelet will remind you that I'm at home waiting for you when you're away. Kill? Never. Snow White wasn't always like this. There must be another way. No! There must be a way to buy us some time to find a cure! <sighs> There's a spell that can cast her into eternal sleep, but it will be dangerous for you as well. 
Hmm, I hid it, but I can't recall where. Oh, the years have taken a toll on my memory. Oof. I know it's somewhere on the second floor. They've tracked you down. Those vermin do have an excellent sense of smell. Ooh, I'll try to slow them down so you can run. Here, this might help you. You didn't think you could just return to the castle, did you, stepmother? Seize her! Welcome home, stepmother. Now you and your magic mirror can serve me. Or you can spend the rest of your life in this dungeon. 
I'll give you one last chance to change your mind. And in case you need some extra motivation, meet your new neighbor. Barely breathing. Something's wrong in the castle, your majesty.
Margaret, it's you. I was afraid I'd never see you again. Hope is the only thing that's kept me alive. I didn't know what was happening. After you left, people began disappearing from the castle, but I thought they'd left of their own accord. I had no idea Snow White was to blame. Here, take this. I was going to try to escape, but I fear I no longer have the strength. Stop Snow White before she destroys the kingdom.
What else do we need for the spell? Hmm. We need a dish of sorcerous black glass and the ripest, sweetest apple from the royal garden. Place a lotus with bloody petals on the apple. You must prick your finger with Snow White's spindle and sprinkle your blood on the petals. You just need to take a bite of this fruit and then let Snow White taste your blood. But hurry before the spell has a chance to kill you!
I'll never help you take over the kingdom. You'll stay a lonely vampire the rest of your days. Oh, we shall see about that. It worked. Snow White's sleeping. Now the kingdom can return to normal and people can go out at night without fear. We hid Snow White for both her safety and everyone else's, while she's sleeping. I have time to find a cure for her curse, even if I have to travel all over the world to do it.